FL Noob Zone. Welcome to the FL Noob Zone. This is the first video in a series of many videos regarding noob FL use. So, getting started. We're, today we're going to do audio recording in FL Studio. Now, what you're going to do is select an input in your mixer. You get to the mixer by following my mouse. Go to View Mixer or press F9 and that will enable your mixer. So I've already selected an input as you saw at the start of the video, but I'm going to do it again for my guitar here. So I'm going to select any insert on this mixer. Go to In, click, choose your input. Um, I'll show you how to set up your audio on another one. But for my guitar, it's analog 2. And then we get guitar. Now, you'll notice when you select an input here, it automatically enables the recording. These discs at the bottom are your recording enabled. So if you right click it, it takes them on and off, okay? That's right click. If you left click, it makes you select a file where you're going to record and your file name. Personally, I just like to click right click and then give her. So I disabled my voice because I don't want to record the voice. I just want to record the guitar, okay? Now what I'm going to do is click the metronome button here so I can have a click like that. And uh, I'll put it on an easy tempo just so I can show you how to record. Now, I'm going to show you a couple things here. Press record and we're going to go, okay? Uh, this right here is a count in this button, 3, 2, 1. Click it and then it'll give you three or four beats before it goes in. Check it out. All right. That didn't do anything um, because it's on pattern mode right now. Normally it's supposed to be in song. So, what you're going to do is click this right here to song, and then we're going to try that again. Alright, so just a quick four bar loop. Now, what I'm going to, you'll notice that you play your clips instantly get put into the playlist. If you don't have your playlist open, you click View Playlist or F5 and that will enable and disable your playlist. So these are the two things you need open to record audio, playlist and mixer. So, and you'll notice I just did a four bar thing there. So I'm going to cut my audio, slice. I will go over this in another video. I'm going to do it really quickly right now. So I just want to show you how to record audio, and that is all. So when I play it back, you'll notice that it is going through zero FX. So it's going through the master. Now what we want to do with recording is actually put it so it records to an effects channel because we want to be able to route that effects to different effects or reverb, sends, and then the way you do that is cl double click the audio clip here and then drag the effects to a mixer track. So I'm going to choose number five. And you'll notice it's going through number five now. Now we can pan it, reduce the volume, etc. Um, but most of all, we can start layering up the guitar. So what I'm going to do here is on insert three, which is still armed, okay. I'm going to show you a shortcut now so I don't have to like click the audio file click the effects and drag it um, all you have to do is route it okay so you're gonna click mixer 3 right here okay click and then we're going to right click on one of these arrows that we want to send the audio to right click this arrow route to this track only okay now your guitar is gonna go through both tracks here and uh, automatically when you record it sends it to this channel so I will show you right now I've got my count in going I don't even need my click but I'm gonna put it on anyways and then I will show you how to layer audio now two 
clips. And <clears throat> you'll notice that this automatically gets routed to channel 4 or mixer track 4, whatever you want to call it. Now they both have their tracks. And you can pan them out. So you get a nice stereo feel. Alright. And there you have it. Basic audio recording. For my next trick, I will make... Uh, I'll show you cutting audio and uh, also bussing, more bussing, okay? Because bussing is super important. Anyways, till next time, bye.